Pet of the Week every Thursday. Sponsored by Joy Law Firm. Just call Joy. Well, it is time for our Pet of the Week, coming to you from Dorchester Paws. Meet Raptor, a three-year-old male mixed breed. He will do best if he's the only prince in the castle. And while he likes rolling solo, he's plenty of dog, weighing in at 85 pounds. He loves kids and being pampered and kissed. And as a side note, Dorchester Paws will no longer be listing specific breeds as part of their marketing efforts. They don't want potential families to simply judge a book by its cover, and because after all, it's the content of their character that counts. Well, moving on to a couple of events, Mutts for Miles is back every Wednesday. Sign up on their website. And need a new ride? Head out tomorrow morning for the Charleston Auto Auction in Monk's Corner. And for our thirsty animal lovers, an adoption event Saturday at Firefly Distillery. It's the Firefly Adopt and Shop. For a list of all the events, head to dorchesterpaws.org. An incredible animal story out of Utah. A man has been reunited with his horse after eight long years. Shane Adams' horse, Mongo, wandered away while they were camping in Utah's West Desert. Bureau of Land Management agents found Mongo running with a herd of wild Mustangs. I mean, it's crazy. He still acts the same. He still acts like the same horse. Eight years of being wild. Yeah, it's like nothing ever happened. Mongo was instantly ready to saddle up and showed no signs of the wild and free years he had spent running with the herd. The horse is about 18 years old now and is perhaps a few hundred pounds underweight. But his owner Shane Adams says he will feed him extra hay and oats to get him back to a healthy weight. Pet of the Week, every Thursday. Sponsored by Joy Law Firm. Just call Joy.